the next part is to discuss how to deal with the very large document that means in your report let's say we have the chapter 1 chapter 2 chapter 3 in the morning we have discussed that all these chapters can be combined quickly and you will get the output so here i want to explain you the concept of the master file so till now we have not discussed anything about the master file you require one master file where you will mention about how many different files you will come you want to combine how to do that so whenever we are mentioning about the master file means we require the preamble into the template as well as the begin document and the end document so that is well known to you but the files which you want to call into this master file there is no need to have any preamble no commands related to the use packages begin backslash document class no need simple text file is required you can call the simple that text file into the master file how to do that that we are going to discuss so next experiment is the seven split the folder you are, you are referring seven split and here split.tex split.tex is the master file split.tex this this uh, split.tex is the master file now i am referring the master file means now soon you will get the idea about what do you mean by the master file see the this portion is the preamble it is available with you then the begin document and document what you will observe input cha1.tex then the second file input backslash input cha2.tex backslash input cha3.tex that means the three different files are there in the folder in the same folder which folder we are referring into that you have the cha1.tex cha2.tex cha3.tex three files are there simple command is there backslash input okay at the same time this this editor will help you to locate these files also say cha1.tx cha2.tx all these files are already available so click this one cha so some contents are there then click onto the cha2 something is still available cha3 it is there okay three different chapters let's say you have large chapters but for the demonstration purpose just we have created the three different files now the split.tex is the master file you have to declare it it is a master file how to declare it is master file go to the options define current document as a master document you are defined because when you run the file initially you have to mention that this document is the master document in the master document you have the preamble but in the remaining files you do not have any preamble just you are going you are you, are, you require the text file not tex files okay so the when you now if you have declared the file if you have declared the file this file is the master file then you are very happy now you can modify any file related to that document whatever you want because you have the multiple files with you let's see how to do that say run this file and observe the output say it will combine all this chapter 1 chapter 2 chapter 3 all the what are the contents are there one by one chapter 1 ke baad chapter 2 3 4 and here you got this thing some some combination of all this okay let's say now you want to have the chapter number 4 with you you want to create the chapter number 4 this one new file we will create without any preamble we will create one new file without any preamble and that file we will save it in the same folder with some name okay and we will input it into the master file let us say how to do that okay file file new here you have the untitled file okay you can type here this is my new file this is my new file this is my new file say this is another additional text file we are creating now we will save it save this file in the same folder as say the aniket.tex aniket.tex and you are in the current folder seven split save this file okay done 
So aniket.txt is the new file you have created. Now you want to input this file into the master file. So master file you can refer. Okay, here you can have the command backslash backslash input input curly bracket. aniket dot tex okay save this file and then run it so what you will observe say whatever you have added it is combined this is my new file the contents are combined so this is a very this this facility is very useful you have the large chapters that means in each chapter you have the suppose the 20 pages and all these 20 20 20 pages you want to combine Individually, you are creating these files. In a master file, just you include it. Put that text file, whatever is there, into that folder. Input into the master file and run it, and you will get the output. So LaTeX will take care related to equations, figure numbers of each and every individual file. Are you getting? Let's say the three students are there in a project. Individually, you have created individual files on your individual machines. and finally want to combine it so very easily you can copy that particular file from the another machine to that particular folder and input into the master file and get it so large documents can be handled very easily that we have discussed okay